hello guys welcome to my channel Ura Tricks and today I'm going to show you uh, the upgradation part of 19.1 uh, version to 20.1 as we have know as we all know that 20.1 version is already there right so let us see I want to show you that current version of my apex is 19.1 and we are going to upgrade this one right so let us see the steps First of all, you have to go to the oracle.com to download the Apex 20.1. This one, 20.1. You need to extract it on your local device. I have already done that. And you need to copy this particular thing, this particular folder that is Apex to C drive. Let me paste at C drive. And this time, I'm going to paste it on a outside absolute see there let it be copied let's just wait for a while okay guys uh, our file has been copied now so the first step is to uh, as we are just upgrading the things so we need to go to the command prompt now currently I'm at my console of C drive you have to connect as a sysdba right so just type oh uh, first thing you have to enter into the apex folder okay you have to see these files right okay now let me type sql plus okay let me connect to sys as sysdba and the password okay and we are got connected right so now we have to execute the installation command that is apex ins dot sql sysox sysox temp ni i think it's correct let me press enter okay it's running so now our uh, apex 20.1 installation has been started and it will take somewhat time because uh, this is uh, one of the longest you know the script which needs to be done it will take almost of uh, 10 to 15 minutes depending on your uh, configuration so i would like to pause the video and we get back to it after it completes Yes, guys, and the installation has been completed, and we are also logged back out. So we need to log in again. So just type uh, the query again, like SQL plus SSSDBA in the password. Okay, we are again. Now we have to execute the second command, uh, which describe the like uh, we are going to load the images. So just type apex underscore epg underscore config dot sql and which will be loaded at c drive colon slash just enter this will be completed soon yeah just wait for a while okay guys we have completed this process also and the last command is remaining now and we need to change the admin password so just type at the rate apxchpwd.sql okay i want to keep it as admin so just enter email is perfect and the password i would like to have this one and it's done now let me exit from here let me open my chrome and let us try to connect the apex now it's not working now we have to connect to the port just wait for a while okay having some issue with the chrome and i'm trying in this my 
Mozilla browser and it's working. So let me logged in as my administrator. Okay, password problem. Okay, I'm logged in now. So you can see my 20.1 version has been installed successfully. Let us check whether our workspace are working or not. So let me check my Aura tricks, username and password. Okay, applications are done and everything is intact absolutely fine and we can see absolutely new version 20.1 and i'm very excited to uh, try some new features whatever it's there okay thank you so much for watching this video if you find uh, if you have any errors or any problems just comments in this video section i will try to sort it out thank you so much